A Literary Discussion by Charles Bukowski From the Pleasures of the Damned A Literary Discussion Markov claims I am trying to stab his soul, but I'd prefer his wife. I put my feet on the coffee table, and he says, I don't mind you putting your feet on the coffee table, except that the legs are wobbly and the thing will fall apart any minute. I leave my feet on the table, but I'd prefer his wife. I would rather, says Markov, entertain a ditch digger or a news vendor because they are kind enough to observe the decencies even though they don't know Rimbaud from rat poison. My empty beer can rolls to the floor. That I must die bothers me less than a straw, says Markov. My part of the game is that I must live the best I can. I grab his wife as he walks, as she walks by, and then her can is against my belly, and she has fine knees and breasts, and I kiss her. It's not so bad being old, he says. A calmness sets in, but here's the catch. To keep calmness and deadness separate, never to look upon youth as inferior because you are old, never to look upon age as wisdom because you have experience, a man can be old and a fool. Many are. A man can be young and wise. Few are. Uh, for Christ, all sake, I wailed. Shut up. He walked over and got his cane and walked out. You've hurt his feelings, she said. He thinks you're a great poet. He's too slick for me, I said. He's too wise. I had one of her breasts out. It was a monstrous, beautiful thing.